Sit. She's like, it's wet, Mom. Sit. Sit. Good girl. Boston Terriers are little dogs with a lot going on. They are loyal. Um, they're smart. They are clowns. And they love companionship. Yes. They just well, love bugs. We'll we'll, so we'll Santi Marcus is committed to helping the breed. This is Lucy. She's the reason I started with the rescue. Come on, buddy! <laughs> Cindy volunteers for the Mid-America Boston Terrier Rescue. We get a lot of our dogs um, from puppy mill auctions. So what happens is when the commercial breeder is done um, using her for profit, they go and sell her at an auction. Rescuing those dogs costs money. His medical bills are upwards of $1,700 at this point. You're okay. You're okay. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, those are clothes. Okay. That's where Cindy comes in. If you do the same thing over and over again, it gets kind of boring. But she has the most creative mind that comes up with some of the neatest ideas for events that draws people in and they have a good time. Cindy's idea for a giant garage sale paid off in a big way recently, raising more than $3,000. All of the money that we raise at our fundraisers goes into the medical fund for Mid-America Boston Terrier Rescue. The Mid-America Boston Terrier Rescue is also unique in that it has a hospice program. We don't just put them down because they're sick. We take care of them and give them the last, you know, the best two weeks of their life or the best six months or year, whatever they've got left. The nonprofit rescues about 300 dogs a year, thanks to dedicated volunteers like Cindy. Colorado is our number one adopting state because we're really cool and dog friendly. I am the only one in the picture without a, a, a dog, but I have a plaque here. For Cindy, because Denver 7 and Papa Murphy's would like to honor you as a 7 Everyday Hero for all your volunteering and work with the group. So congratulations. Thank you very much. We need to howl now, don't we? Yeah, there you go. Nice work, nice work.